The gospel reading is from uh, Matthew, chapter 4, verses 1 through 11. Then Jesus was led up by the Spirit into the wilderness to be tempted by the devil. And he fasted 40 days and 40 nights, and afterward he was hungry. And the tempter came and said to him, If you are the Son of God, command these stones to become loaves of bread. But he answered, It is written, Man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds from the mouth of God. Then the devil took him to the holy city and set him on the pinnacle of the temple and said to him, If you are the Son of God, throw yourself down, for it is written, He will give his angels charge of you, and on their hands they will bear you up, lest you strike your foot against a stone. Jesus said to him, Again, it is written, You shall not tempt the Lord your God. Again, the devil took him to a very high mountain and showed him all the kingdoms of the world and the glory of them. And he said to them, All these I will give you if you will fall down and worship me. Then Jesus said to him, Be gone, Satan, for it's written, You shall worship the, God, the Lord your God, and him only shall you serve. Then the devil left him, and behold, angels came and ministered to him. Good morning to all. I thank God for giving me this privilege to share the word of God with you and all. I thank Pastor Kate Payton and Pastor Bill Jones and all the elders of the church and all the members of the congregation for giving me this precious opportunity to share the love of God with you all. Thank you. ఈ దినము కొరక ఏర్పాటు చేయబడిన పాత నిబంధన పాఠము ఆది కాండము రెండవ అధ్యాయము పదిహేను నుండి పదిహేడు మూడు నుండి ఒకటి ఏడు వరకు మనం చదువుతున్నాం ఈ చదివిన పాఠ్యభాగంలో దేవుడు ఆదా మామల్ని ఏదని తోటలో పెట్టి ఆ తోటని సేర్చిపరచుటకు దాన్ని కావలి కాయటానికి అప్పగించాడు In the scripture passage that we read, um, we, we read that God made Adam and Eve and he put them in the Garden of Eden and uh, he, uh, he gave it to them to cultivate it. I think that the Lord said that the Lord has given you the first time of the Lord. But the Lord has given you the first time of the Lord and the Lord has given you the first time of the Lord. The Lord has given you the first time of the Lord and the Lord has given you. He, when God gave them the, 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 put them in the Garden of Eden, he told them that they can eat from all, any fruit in the, in the garden except for the tree that bears the fruit of knowledge uh, of good and evil. When God said you will die, he did not mean physically die, but uh, in, a, uh, in a spiritual way, um, he, they will die. అయితే అవ్వ ఏం చేసిందంటే ఒంటరిగా ఉంది ఆ సమయం చూసుకుని సాతాను సత్వం రూపంలో ఆమె దగ్గరకు వచ్చాడు మాట్లాడడం మొదలు పెట్టాడు అవ్వ మాట్లాడుతున్నప్పుడు అవ్వలో సందేహాన్ని పెట్టాడు When he was talking with Eve, the first thing he did was to put a doubt in her mind. He said, His first thing was he asked a question, uh, to, to, uh, basically uh, questioning if God said what he said. Eve talked to the serpent uh, longer than she should have. And the one who said, 
ఒక ఛాన్స్ దొరికింది అయితే వాక్యంలో ఏమి రాయబడిందంటే ప్రోవర్బ్స్ టెన్ నైన్టీన్లో మీరు విస్తారంగా మాట్లాడద్దు అని ఉంది ఇన్ ప్రోవర్బ్స్ టెన్ నైన్టీన్ ఇట్ ఈస్ రిటర్న్ when when words are many transgression is not lacking vistaranga maatladam valla taanu mosamla padipoyindi with with all the with all the uh, words and conversation that she had with the serpent she was uh, she fell into the trap that uh, satan was creating through the serpent avva aidu tappulu chesindi in uh, we can we can um, when we look at the passage we can see five things that eve did okate adam ki dooram ga undi she was uh once she was away from adam wonder ga undi she was alone serpent tho vistarinchi maatladindi she she talked to serpent for lo- longer than she should have aithe serpent cheppina maatalu nammindi she believed in the words of the serpent devudu cheppina maatalu nammaledu by not believing in the words of god adi moodo tappu that's the third th- the third mistake aa tarvata aa phalam choose tinadi and she ate the fruit ante kaadu aa phalam ni teesukelle aadam ki ichindi in addition to that she she went and gave the fruit to adam aayana kuda tinnadu and he also ate it aayana kuda tappu chesadu and they by he did the same mistake that eve did ante ee aidu tappulu valla and because of these five things sarpamu ee avani shodinchindi serpent was uh, prodding eve aithe ఈ వృక్ష ఫలం ఎలా ఉంది లెట్స్ లుక్ ఎట్ ద లుక్ లెట్స్ లెర్న్ మోర్ అబౌట్ ద ట్రీ దట్ హౌ ద ట్రీ వాస్ ఆ వృక్ష ఫలము తెలివి జ్ఞానం ఇచ్చేటి ఫలము మంచి చెడ్డలు తెలిపేటువంటి ఫలము ఇట్ ఇస్ ద ట్రీ ఆఫ్ నాలెడ్జ్ ఆఫ్ గుడ్ అండ్ ఈవిల్ అది ఈ అవ చూసినప్పుడు ఎలా ఉందంటే వెన్ ఈవ్ సో ద ట్రీ ఆహారం నాకు మంచి ఇట్ ఇట్ వాస్ గుడ్ ఫర్ ఫుడ్ కన్నులకు అందమైంది ప్లెజెంట్ టు ది ఐస్ వివేకమిచ్చి రమ్యమైంది and to be desired to make to make you wise ఒకటవ జాను 2 16 17 చూస్తే in first john chapter 2 16 and 17 verses దాల వ్రాసింది ఏంటంటే for for all that is in the world the desires of the flesh and the desires of the eyes and the pride of life is not from the father but is from the world అవును అది ఆహారం నాకు మంచిది అంటే when it is when it said when it was said it is good for food that means it is lust of flesh it is the lust of flesh that we read in john chapter 2 అది కన్నులకు మంచిదిగా ఉంది అందంగా ఉంది అంటే when it's it said it's pleasant to the eyes అది నేత్రాస it is it is the lust of the eyes అది రమ్యమైంది వివేకం ఇచ్చింది అంటే it is desired to make you wise means అది అది it's karma pr- it's pride of life pride of life aithe ee mood chupinchi with these three temptations satan amen lobarchukundi satan was able to uh, able to make eve commit the sin adhe vidhanga in the same way matthi suvartha 4th adhyayam 1 to 11 chusinappudu in the gospel scripture that we read matthew 4 1 to 11 యేసు ప్రభుని కూడా సాతాన్ అలానే శోధించింది సాటన్ ఆల్సో టెంప్టెడ్ జీసస్ ఇన్ ద సేమ్ మోర్ ఆర్ లెస్ ద సేమ్ వే ఆయన ఆహారం ఆకలి కొన్నప్పుడు when he was hungry ఈ రాళ్ళను రొట్టెలుగా చేసుకొని తినమంది సాటన్ asked him to make the stone into bread అంటే అది శరీరాశ that is lust for flesh lust of flesh ఆయన గోపురము పైకి తీసుకెళ్ళిపోయి when 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 the satan took jesus to the mountain ఇక్కడ నుండి దుమ్కేయం అన్నాడు and asked him to throw himself down ante suicide cheskomandi so thereby killing himself or or thereby prompting him that he will be saved by the angels idi lust of life that's lust of life moodadiga avada anni kingdoms chupichesi satanu kingdoms anni chupinchi the third thing that satan did was he, he showed the glory of all the kingdoms in the world వీటన్నిటిని నీకు ఇస్తాను నాకు నమస్కారం చేయమంది హీ ప్రామిస్ దట్ ఇఫ్ జీసస్ జీసస్ ప్రైస్ టు సాటన్ హీ హీ విల్ హీ విల్ బీ ద కింగ్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ దోస్ కింగ్డమ్స్ 
అంటే ఇది ఇది లస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఐస్ అండ్ దట్స్ ది లస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఐస్ నేత్రాశ అయితే సాతాను అలా శోధించినప్పుడు when satan tempted jesus in those three ways yesu prabhu danni edrincharu jesus stood up and she, he confronted satan elagante how he did that vakyam lo raasindi chupincharu he did that by by showing satan what was written in the scriptures it is written ani chepparu it is he, he told satan that it was written in scriptures ante vakyam dwara aa satanu edrincharu using the word of god he was able to confront satan alagu in the same way netrasa sharirasa jeevudamulam anetavatni ayina jeyinchadu he won over the lust of eyes the lust of flesh and the pride of life satan nor muinchadu thereby run, um, thereby uh, pa- confronting the satan Resist. and his temptations andola satan akkadu nundi ellipoyindi and satan ran away from that ఏంజల్స్ వచ్చి ఆయన కంఫర్ట్ చేశారు అండ్ గాడ్స్ ఏంజల్స్ కేమ్ అండ్ అటెండ్ హిమ్ ఆఫ్టర్ దట్ అదే విధంగా ఇన్ ది సేమ్ వే ఇప్పటి కూడా టు దిస్ డే సాతాన్ మనల్ని సాటన్ ట్రైస్ టు టెంప్ట్ us మనల్ని శోధించడానికి మొదలు పెడుతుంది షీ హీ ట్రైస్ టు టెంప్ట్ us ఇన్ ది సేమ్ వే శరీరాశ నేత్రాశ అని జీవుడమ్మ అనే వాటిని చూపించి హీ షోస్ us the lust of eyes lust of uh, lust of uh, life and the pride of life sufferings dwara and using our sufferings man temptation loki nadutundi he will try to tempt us man chaala saru chaala suffer avutu untam we we have, we go through a lot of sufferings in our daily life aa sufferings lo konni ikkada cheppal anukuntunanu and uh, i'm i'm going to mention a few of those um, here uh, some of them are ill health a loss of kith and kin non cooperation of partner uh, d- disobedience of children dissatisfaction in job frustration troubles in relationships worry about future insecurities accidents and economical problems ivanni manandriki sambhavinchayi these are these are some of the things that happen in our day to day lives these are sufferings these are these are sufferings is the sufferings dwara and through these satan manan devuriki dooram cheyalani using these sufferings that we face in our lives manalni shodhistundi Satan is using them to tempt us to do sin. These sufferings are our cross. These sufferings are our cross. Mana semalu. These are our sufferings. Aithe ee vaakyam em cheptundante? The word of God tells us. Mark 8:34 and calling the crowd to him and calling the crowd to him with his disciples he said to them if anyone would come after me let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow follow me evaraina nannu vembadinchukoni ella if anyone would come after me thannu thanu upekshinchukoni he has to deny himself pratidinamu and every day thana silivu nettukoni he has to take up his cross nannu vembadinchavarenu and follow follow him every day and it's every day manak sufferings tappakunda untai we go through sufferings every day kaani adi mana cross and that there is the cross that we need to bear manam prakana pettaniki veelledu we cannot put them aside adi evariki ivadaniki veelledu we cannot give them to somebody else okka roju moyadaniki kaadu it's not for one day every day it's every day edho oka paddathilo in in one way or the other suffering vastundi we face sufferings aina kuda even then aa suffering mana cross ni we uh, the, the suffering ane mana cross ni and the suffering as we had with the suffering as our cross mana ettukoni we we bear it on ourselves every day and every day moyalsindi we have to go, we have to bear our cross kani manam yesuni vemadinchali and doing and all through that we have to follow jesus manaku oka example undi we have a few examples mana bible lo chuste in the bible yobu ane oka bhaktulu unnadu we see we see job meer andaru vine untaru you might have already know the story chaala dhanavantudu he was a wealthy man పది మంది పిల్లలు ఉన్నారు హీ హ్యాడ్ టెన్ చిల్డ్రన్ సెవెన్ బాయ్ సెవెన్ మేల్ అండ్ త్రీ ఫీమేల్ సెవెన్ సన్స్ అండ్ త్రీ డాటర్స్ ప్రాపర్టీ అంతా ఒకే రోజు పోయింది హీ లాస్ట్ ఆల్ హిస్ ఆల్ హిస్ బిలాంగింగ్స్ ఆల్ హిస్ ప్రాపర్టీ ఇన్ వన్ డే ఏడుగురు కొడుకులు ముగ్గురు కుమార్తెలను ఒకే రోజు పోగొట్టుకున్నాడు హీ లాస్ట్ హిస్ సెవెన్ సన్స్ అండ్ త్రీ డాటర్స్ ఆన్ ద సేమ్ డే అయితే దేవుణ్ణి దూషించలేదు 
but even then he did not deny jesus noti maatato kuda ayana jesu devuni dikshinchaledu even then he did not deny jesus with his words yobu bhari ochindi yobu's wife talked to him nee devuni dooshinchi maranam kamman cheppindi she uh, she advised him to deny his 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 god and and commit suicide kani yobu venledu but job did not listen yehova ichanu He, he said in job 121 the lord gave and the lord has taken away blessed be the name of the lord yehova ichinu yehova tisukunu devu namuke sthuti kalpinu kaaka sthutinchadu he praised god saying the lord gave and the lord has taken away blessed be the name of the god he is carrying the cross he was carrying the cross of his suffering aithe yobu noti maata tho kuda paapam cheyaledu even then he did not commit sin and vela devudu and the, and because of that aini rendu antalaga divinchadu blessed him uh, blessed him Double. twice doubly marala 10 members ichadu 10 kids ichadu he gave him 10 uh, other children yob yokka kumarthallo prapanchamlo evaru anta andagatha lerata he gave he gave him beautiful daughters antaka aashirvadinchadu and he blessed him abundantly ayana pogutukunna aasthanta marla ichadu he got back what all he lost endukante ayana devunni vembarinchadu this because he was following the lord even through his suffering kabatti manam dhairyam techukovali and we should we should take heart in that samallo kungi pogodudu we should not we should not be discouraged in our suffering aithe parishuddhani paul em cheptunnadu samal gurinchi chuddam the uh, apostle paul uh, we'll see what apostle paul is talking about in uh, uh, about suffering meek vishwasam unchadame kaadu kaani samanubhavam kuda meek anugrahinchabadindi ani cheptunadu when we believe apostle paul is saying that uh, it's not, not only believing but also suffering ante kaadu aa suffering lo nundi bayitiki vache margam kuda devudu chupistadu ani cheptunadu and he is also uh, telling us that god will make a way for us to come out of that యేసు ప్రభు అయితే ఏం చెప్తున్నారంటే అండ్ జీసస్ టోల్డ్ us లేచి ప్రార్థించండి మీరు సోదరుల ప్రవేశింపకున్నట్టు అంటున్నాడు హి ఆస్క్డ్ us to rise and pray so so that you may not enter into temptation మన ప్రభు ప్రార్థనలో లార్డ్స్ ప్రేయర్ లో చెప్తున్నారు and in the lord's prayer he taught us సోదరులకు మనం తేవొద్దు అని చెప్తున్నారు lead us not into temptation అలా ప్రార్థన చేయాలి మనం and we have to we have to pray for that అయితే పరిశుద్ధుడైన పేత్రు ఏం చెప్తున్నారంటే సెయింట్ పీటర్ ఇస్ టెలింగ్ us మీరు శ్రవణ అనుభవించినప్పుడు when you are in uh, going through fire bahuga santoshinchade antnadu greatly rejoice he is he is asking us to greatly rejoice endukante mee vishwasam parikshipa padutundi ani artham that's because your faith is being tested ante kaadu not only that yesu prabhu yokka shramallo meer paali bhagasthulu when going through our trials we we are partaking in the suffering that jesus went through kabatti santoshinchandi for that rejoice అయితే యాకోబో ఏం చెప్తున్నాడు అంటే జేమ్స్ ఇన్ ద ఇన్ ద ఇన్ ద బుక్ ఆఫ్ జేమ్స్ సోదరు సహించువాడు ధన్యుడు అని చెప్తున్నాడు బ్లెస్డ్ ఇస్ ద మ్యాన్ దట్ ఎండ్యూరెడ్ ద టెంప్టేషన్ ఎందుకంటే అతను జీవ కిరీటాన్ని పొందుతాడట ఫర్ హిస్ రివార్డ్ విల్ బి ద క్రౌన్ ఆఫ్ లైఫ్ కాబట్టి శ్రమలు పొందిన వాళ్ళు బాధపడకర్లేదు సో వి షుడ్ నాట్ బి డిస్కరేజ్ when we are going through suffering దేవుడు మనకి రివార్డ్ ఇవ్వబోతున్నాడు గాడ్ ఇస్ గోయింగ్ టు గివ్ us a reward వాటిని మనం భరిస్తానే as we bear our cross mana yesu vembadinchali we have to follow jesus aithe alaga ee temptation overcome cheyali and how do we overcome this temptation idi chaala kashtamaina pani that's a, that's a tough thing to do kaani manam cheyochu but we can still do it with the word of god with the word of god vakyam dwara ne only with the word of god endukante vakyamu aina sword sword of the spirit because the word of god is the sword of the spirit idi aatma kadgamu antam we call it the sword of the spirit ee kadgam tho manam apodini edrinchali that is the sword we can use to confront satan dan koraku manam em cheyali what do we need to do for that we have to fill our heart with the word we have to fill our heart with the word manam devun vakyam tho nimpukovali we have to fill our heart with the word manaki devun vakyam man cheyathilo undi we have it in our hands aadi endu vakyam undenu వాక్యం దేవుని యొక్క దండను వాక్యం దేవుడై ఉండను అంటంది జాన్ 1 1 ఇన్ ద బిగినింగ్ ద వర్డ్ ద వర్డ్ వాస్ గాడ్ ద వర్డ్ ఇస్ విత్ గాడ్ అండ్ ద వర్డ్ వాస్ గాడ్ వాక్యాన్ని మన హృదయంలో నింపుకున్నప్పుడు 
when we fill our hearts with the word of god devudu man hrudayamlo untadu god will be in our hearts sword man daggara untadi and we will have the sword manam aatma kadgunta shodhana jeyinchagalamu we can use that sword of the spirit to yeah. to to be victorious on evil yesu prabhu kuda alane jeyincharu satanni jesus won in the same way roju ku okka verse kattadi pedthe if we memorize one verse a day 30 days lo 30 avutayi we will have 30 we will we will have uh, memorize 30 in a in a month 365 rojullo in a, in 365 days 365 vakyalu mana hrudayamlo untayi we will have 365 verses in our heart ante devudu mana hrudayamlo unnadu that means we sh- will have god in our heart because god is word because god is word so mana hrudayallo devu nimpukundam so for that let's fill our heart with the word of god mana satan tho fight cheyadaniki devu upayogapadtadi this is the only thing we have to fight satan aa tarvata and after that vakyanni prarthana dwara meditate cheyadam we can use the word to we can meditate on the word in our prayer prarthana meditation two wings um prayer and meditation and the, are med- two wings ఒక పక్షి ఎగరాలంటే ఇఫ్ ఎ బర్డ్ హస్ టు ఫ్లై రెండు రెక్కలు కావాల్సింది ఇట్ నీడ్స్ బోత్ ది వింగ్స్ ఒక్క రెక్క తో ఎగరలేదు వి కెన్ నాట్ డు ఇట్ విత్ వన్ వింగ్ కాబట్టి ప్రార్థన ఇన్ ది సేమ్ వే ప్రేయర్ దేవుని వాక్యాన్ని మెడిటేట్ చేయడం అండ్ మెడిటేటింగ్ ఆన్ ది వర్డ్ ఆఫ్ గాడ్ ఈ రెండు మన వింగ్స్ ఆర్ ఆర్ आवर వింగ్స్ అప్పుడు మనం దేవుని యొక్క ఉన్నత స్థలం మీద ఎగరగలం ఇన్ ఓన్లీ దెన్ వి కెన్ ఫ్లై టు యు ది హైయర్ ప్లేసెస్ దట్ గాడ్ వాంట్స్ us to be ఆత్మ కడ్డం తో సాతాన్ని ఎదిరించగలం వి కెన్ వి కెన్ confront satan with the sword of the spirit eppudaithe mana vakyam tho nimpabaddamo when we are filled with the uh, word mana hrudayamu aatma tho nimpabadtadi we will be filled with the holy spirit because god is holy because god is holy kabatti mana parishuddha parichabadtam and and for that we will be holy eppudaithe aatma tho nimpabadtamo when we are filled with the spirit appudu aatmala phalistamu we will bear fruit of the spirit spirit dinne manam aatma phalamu antamu and we we call that the fruit of the spirit galati 5 22 lo in galatians 5 4 aatma phalam gurinchi raayabadundi we we learn about the fruits of spirit uh, love joy peace long suffering kindness goodness faith meekness and self control are the fruits of the spirit orange fruit teeskunte if we take a, f- a fruit of orange for example dan lo tomidi parts untai there are there are all, about nine slices these nine parts are and the 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 the, the, the nine fruits of the spirit that we just read about in the fruit are the uh, are part are like the slices of the kabatti mana phalam lo mana aatma phalam lo for for big for in the spirit in the fruit of our spirit love joy peace love joy peace long suffering kindness goodness faith meekness and self control ivanni untai will all be there manam eppudaithe aatmalo phalistamo when we bear the fruit of spirit avi bayitku vastayi they they will show they, they they will be evident in us ave man suffering nundi bayitku vastayi and and these are the fruit that we get the, that we bear after going through our trials and sufferings ee phalam dwara and because when with that fruit of spirit manu yesu prabhu sishyulu vani telisipadtadu we know that we are the disciples of god of jesus manu aatmalo phalinchinappudu when we bear fruit with the, bear the fruit of the spirit tandri mahim parchabadtadu the god is glorified kabatti manu aa sishyulu avutam and and we become the disciples of jesus manaku evvar namsham our topic for today disciple will you trust me is disciple will you trust me ఇవాళ దేవుడు మనల్ని అడుగుతున్నాడు టుడే గాడ్ ఇస్ ఆస్కింగ్ us మనం ఆయన ఎందుకు విశ్వాసం ఉంచుతున్నామా ఇఫ్ వి ఆర్ కీపింగ్ అవర్ ఫేత్ ఇన్ హిమ్ మనం విశ్వాసం ఉంచితే ఇఫ్ వి ఆర్ కీపింగ్ అవర్ ఫేత్ మన శిలువును మనం ఎత్తుకొని వి వి బేర్ అవర్ క్రాస్ ఎవరీ డే ఆయన్ని వెంబడించాలి అండ్ ఫాలో హిమ్ ఆత్మలో ఫలించాలి వి హావ్ టు బేర్ ద ఫ్రూట్ ఆఫ్ ద స్పిరిట్ అప్పుడే మనం ఆయన శిష్యులు అంటే పిలువబడతాం we only then we will be called disciples of jesus అప్పుడే మనం దేవుని మహిమపరుస్తాము only then we will will glorify god danni batti manamu devuni pillalam ani andarki telustadi because of that the world will know that we are the disciples of christ mana aadamu avalu kolpoyinatvanti pannu tinnavaddanu pannu tintam dwara 
Adam and Eve, because they ate the fruit that they are forbidden to eat, they were thrown out of the Garden of Eden. But if we bring forth the fruit of the Spirit, we will inherit the kingdom of God. And, and, and through that, we are regaining what Adam and, uh, Adam and Eve lost that day. And that is only possible with the sword of the Spirit. That's only possible with the word of God. The word is with us. But we put our uh, we put our Bibles in the shelves. And that's not for that's not the reason for that. That. We need to store it in our heart. And the, because there will be a day. There will be a day when there will be a, a, a lack of word. Even when you search from the east to west. You, you cannot find the word of God. Even when you search from sea to one sea to another sea. We will not find it. It's written in the book of Amos. It is, it is written that it will, be, it, it will be a drought for the word of God. And, and, and in those days, uh, we will not find it no matter how we search it. And when the word of the God is with us, we have to store it. We will let's store it in our hearts. Let's meditate on the word. By meditation, rumination antaru. It's called rumination. Jantuvleem jaste ante. The way animals do it, some of the animals. Ahar kan kan pichra apnu grass kan pichra apnu baga baba tinya ste. When they see when they see grass, they they quickly eat how how much ever they can. And when they are leisure and, and, and when they are resting, they bring back the food that they, uh, they quick, quickly ate and bring them back into the mouth and they chew on them and, and swallow it again. In the same way, we have to, we have to listen to the word of God but and we have to go back to it and meditate on it. And God will open up his, uh, God will talk, us, talk to us through that. And we have to we have to store the word of God in our hearts when we have it abundantly available. And we and we have to teach it to our kids. We have to raise them in the word of God from when they are kids. When they grow up, they will not listen to us. They are not, it's happening even at a younger age. Nowadays. And when they become older, they will not listen to us. And for that reason, we have to teach them the word of God when they are kids. We have to teach them to praise God. We have to teach them on how to worship God. We have to tell them what's good and what's evil. We have to raise them for God. We cannot say that they grew up and became somebody else. If something happens to them when they grow up and they go astray, it is on us. That's because we did not do what we need to do when they were kids. We have to raise them in the word of God. We have to raise them in the word of God. Otherwise, we will lose our kids. We have to show them the way. Show, show, show the child. Train up the child. Train up the child. When he was a kid and he will not go astray when he is. And for that reason we have to teach our kids when they are still. They will learn very quickly. 
in the way that we cannot manam gurtunchukolemu we cannot memorize what kaani vaadu chaala baa gurtinchukuntaru we cannot memorize what they can kabatti manam cheyalsina pani adi that's the thing so that's what we need to do manam vaakyam chadavali we have to read the word of god manam vaakya manam hrudayanni nimpukovali we have to fill our spirits mana biddalaku nerpali we have to teach our kids vaadanu kuda సాతాన్ ఎదురించు నేర్పించాలి వి హావ్ టు టీచ్ దెమ్ హౌ టు కన్ఫ్రంట్ సైటన్ వెన్ దే ఆర్ వెన్ దే హావ్ సేడ్ వెన్ దే గో త్రూ సంథింగ్ లైక్ దట్ అప్పుడే మన కుటుంబాలు నిలబడతాయి దెన్ ఓన్లీ आवर ఫ్యామిలీస్ విల్ స్టాండ్ అప్పుడే మన కుటుంబంలో నెమ్మది ఉంటది దెన్ ఓన్లీ విల్ హావ్ పీస్ ఇన్ आवर ఫ్యామిలీస్ లేదంటే మనకు సఫరింగ్ తప్పదు ఇఫ్ నాట్ వి హావ్ టు గో త్రూ ది సఫరింగ్ అలా చేసి మన అందరం దేవుని కొరకు బ్రతకాలి ఇన్ డూయింగ్ ఆల్ దట్ వి హావ్ టు లివ్ ఫర్ జీసస్ క్రైస్ట్ పరలోక రాజ్యం సంపాదించుకోవాలి we have to uh, we, we have to inherit the kingdom of god ఇవన్నీ నేను ఏ థియలాజికల్ కాలేజ్లో నేర్చుకోలేదు i did not learn these things in any theological college or seminary i learned everything at the feet of jesus christ దేవుని పాదాల దగ్గర నేర్చుకున్నాను i learned them at the feet of christ దేవుని వాక్యాన్ని మెడిటేట్ చేయడం నేర్చుకున్నాను I learned how to meditate on the word of God. Munduga na hrudayanni devunu vakyamtho nimpukunnanu. I filled my uh, my heart with the word of God. Aa tarvata devudu nannu aathmatho fill chesadu. And God filled me with this with his spirit. Andukane nenu vakyam cheppagalugutunnanu. That's the only reason I can uh, that I can come here and stand and share the word of God with you. Devudu man andarni okay laga premisthunnadu. God loves each and every one of us in the same andarni way. Andarni premisthunnadu. He is loving each and one, every one. Yavariki ayin doorasudu kaadu. he is not away from any of us manam ayin cheptattu vinte if we listen to him manam peaceful ga untam we will be peaceful manam heaven ni pontam we will inherit the kingdom kabatta ala cheyalani meer andaru i request all of you to do that from today onwards you please get by heart one verse a day and by the next first week of lent you may see wonders because you will learn 365 verses and your god will be in your heart you have the sword of spirit and you will be successful thank you thank you